So as I mentioned in another video, I uh, I just want to mention this now because this looks all choppy and shit. It's not factory. I actually painted the wood grain on here, and uh, it wasn't too difficult if you got a little, I don't know, like artistic ability, I guess, because uh, it wasn't just like spray it on and you're done. You kind of had to. There's a technique to it. I could I could tell anybody if if you want if you're interested in painting wood grain, I could show you how I did it. Um, but I would get a little bit of light from at night when I turn my dash lights on shining through on that around the edge here so what I did actually was all up around here what I did was I filled <coughs> I filled in here with I believe I used weather strip adhesive but really anything that you can get to bond up here you just don't want to block off the light comes through this little clear lens right here there's a I guess a light bulb like way in the back there and it comes through here you don't want to block that off you just want to block it off from coming through on top I don't know how well you guys can see that but just in case you have that problem on your Ford Ranger or Explorer or any vehicle for that matter that's a little a little trick that I figured out I could just put a little bit of that up there make sure you don't make too much of a mess take your time with it you know and let it dry first and then don't put the knob on before it's dry but once it's dry, or if the knob is out of the way, you just pop that on. And you don't see it anymore. Ta-da!